Hey there, cow cup. I feel awesome. I want to yell that this morning. I'm going to go outside and try yelling it not into the kid's window this week. I think that every week as we're starting a new week. Now, I don't know if you start your new week on Monday or what day of the week or how you think about it. You know, once you start working from home, you find that every day is sort of the same. And I, it's been a couple of years now, so I actually will admit that I find myself losing track sometimes of what day of the week it is. So when you plan your own schedule and do what you want when you want, it's really interesting. But sometimes, you know, it's kind of like on vacation. You forget what day of the week it is sometimes. When you're working from home, sometimes that happens more often than just like when you're on vacation. But some, I think our bodies have this circadian rhythm and we still kind of know when it's Monday morning and the beliefs and thoughts and the impressions from the past sort of sneak in. Because I woke up this morning and I'm like, nah. And I'm like, I never wake up nah, on, a, on a Monday. And then I realized it was Monday. I didn't even know what day of the week it really was. And I'm like, it's Monday. And then I have a friend, Stephen Larson, who yells, it's Monday, baby. And he yells a lot louder than that. But I still have people sleeping in my house, so I'm not going to yell it. But I do think I'm going to go out in the driveway this morning and go on my Instagram and yell, I feel awesome, so that I can wake myself up and feel awesome today. Because I've got a great week ahead, and I want to feel awesome. So do you do tricks like that to yourself? Do you do things to, we all need to, right? There's things that we have to do in our lives and in our businesses for sure that we don't love. But that's part of why our businesses succeed is because we're willing to do the things that other people aren't willing to do that we don't necessarily love. And although, yes, we should be in a business that we love and that makes our hearts sing and that we're passionate about and that we want to do and we serve people in ways that we would do even if we weren't being paid because we love doing it so much, but any business has aspects of it that we don't love. I mean, I will admit I don't love the financial stuff, the accounting, the keeping track of money and things. I don't love it. I don't want to do it. It's detail stuff. Anything that's really super duper nitty gritty detail things, not my thing. I am totally a big picture strategy gal. And so when it comes down to, you know, dotting my I's and crossing my T's, that's not my thing. I need somebody to actually come behind and, and dot those I's and cross those T's for me because I gave up perfectionism a long, long time ago. Like, I don't think I ever had that bug. So what do you do to feel awesome, to get yourself psyched up when you're necessarily, you got you to gotta get your energy up, but you're not necessarily feeling terrific. What do you do? What's something that you do? Well, I will maybe have a cup of coffee in a, in a cute coffee mug, or I will go outside and I will yell, I feel awesome, or I will take a deep breath or meditate or think of things I want or think of something positive or focus on an experience from my past that worked out really well that gave me energy and made me feel excited about something. Or I will look for what in the task or the thing that I have to do could I be curious about? Could I be interested in? What, and I always ask myself, what can I learn from this experience? And even if it's that yeah, I still don't like doing it. You know, I'm never going to like doing dishes, but I always like when they're done. I'm never going to like doing laundry, but I always like when all my clothes are clean and I don't have to think about it. I'm, there's things like that in our lives, but there's also things like that in our businesses. So today I am going to focus on feeling awesome no matter what comes my way. And I would encourage you to do the same. Have a fantastic day and I will report back tomorrow with what I'm up to now.